All right, it is nine o'clock. I'm all loaded up. Deer Park Mountain Shelter. Walking down toward the trail. We've got three, roughly three and a half miles to go. And uh, it's, today is going to be a beautiful day. It's very chilly. Still barely see my breath. But as soon as I start walking, it's going to heat right up. This is uh, the water source. Slow trickle, but good enough to refill water. We don't need much to get to hot springs today. I'll show you the water source here. Oh. Hey, how you doing? All right, heading out. That's a little cool. Got my buff on and climbing up this hill. That's where I came from, going up a pretty steep hill. And watch out for the sun. Here we go. Uh, this is where I'm going. A little under three miles to Hot Springs. All right, that's where I came from, and this is where I'm going. This is the Hot Springs Trailhead. Just have a little ways to walk. Tom will have his car, so doing good. In two and a half days, we've done 32 miles. Faster than I thought, but we need to do that for car shuttling purposes. Anyway, this is the trailhead. Cool. Walking into Hot Springs. Follow the AT on the sidewalk. Awesome. Okay, it is a quarter till four, and I'm walking down to pick up Tom and our packs where we let them all out. I was laugh I parked the car up at Laughing, Laughing Whatever Hostel, and uh, I think we're going to go up on top of that big puppy. We got a big climb coming up. We're hoping to get him four or five miles and then camp. That'll give us a good start on tomorrow. Weather's great, and uh, rain will be coming in tonight or early in the morning so we definitely this could be our last good day for two or th for at least two days all right this will be day what is it day four can't remember the name of the river right here at hot springs there's Tom up there. We cross this, and then we head to the right. We head to the right. We're going to go up those mountains. I think we're going to curve all the way around, eventually all the way up to that mountain there. I think. We'll see. Well, this part of the trail just out of Hot Springs runs right along this beautiful river. I'll try to put the river name in the caption. And Hot Springs is known for hikers and uh, whitewater rafting, canoeing. And it's a small town, it's a beautiful little town. Highly recommended. Uh, anyway, we've got almost five miles where we want to stop for a tent site. And it's supposed to be rainy either tonight or tomorrow, so we'll see. But wow, this is just 
so far it's beautiful and we'll soon be hitting a steep uphill that'll take my breath away at a waterfall I mean slight waterfall all right crosses the whole river All right, this is a ledge, this rock straight down. There's the town of Hot Springs. What a beautiful view. And that's where we came from, where Tom's coming up. It got really sketchy because there was several places. If you slipped, it was death, right? That's where I'm coming from. Look at this sun shining over there. Beautiful. I'm not gonna zoom in. And this is where we're going. Probably a little over a mile from some pond area where they claim we can, there's room for tents. That'd put us close to five miles. Actually, bonus five in a way, because I originally had planned to only stop in hot springs. All right. All right, we're coming up on the walled pond where we're hoping to camp on one side. It's not formal camping, but supposedly we should be able to camp. All right, Tom is all packed up. I'm close, I just have to down my tent, put everything up. This was a good sight last night, but we're looking at high percent of rain coming anytime soon. So we're gonna try to book it six miles to the nearest shelter and uh, we'll see what happens. This may be the only recording for the day. What's today, the fourth day, isn't it, Tom? All right. Let's, it's only about 8.20 in the morning, but it's dark in the green tunnel. That's because totally overcast forecast. Uh, I think 40% chance of rain in the next two hours it should start. Left camp about 8.15, and Tom left about uh, 10 minutes in front of me. He's going to stop and get water. We'd like to make uh, this shelter that was six miles from where we camped before we try to eat anything or drink my coffee. I gotta have my coffee. Uh, anyway, train's pretty good right now. If we, we might go 15, almost 16 to a shelter, depending on weather conditions. If it's raining, we'll probably gut it out and, and make it to the shelter. Don't know how much I'll be able to film or take pictures. Hopefully, won't miss too many good views. I've had some already. All right. That's where I came from.
This is where I'm going. Thought I'd do a quick video. This is a light breeze. We've had some really heavy ones. The colors are real nice. I'm definitely steady uphill. This is a really a killer climb. Okay. To say the wind is strong is an understatement. Wait till I get up there. Look at this though. Oh man. Pretty view. People have camped right here. You can see the trees blowing. All right, let's do this. All right, I'm at the top. The wind is howling. I was hoping on this side, this side is blowing directly at me, but there's no windows in this, so definitely I'm getting hit hard with the breeze. Wow, what beauty. I'm so glad I came up here. Let me zoom in on that. Oh. Nice. One more time in case I missed it because I wasn't sure I had record on. As I turn this second corner, the wind just about blows you down. This is a really sturdy fire tower. Man, this went right in front of my feet. These are huge too. That would have, that could have, really, that could have knocked me out or worse from way up high. I gotta get out of here. There might be another piece. Hot damn. Holy crap. That would be bad luck. The wind coming out of this, yeah, this valley down here. Like 45 to 50 mile an hour wind. I don't know what it gusts up to. Alright, Tom's putting his uh, backpack on, but he's already got it over his shoulders. The last time he stepped backwards and almost went down a really steep hill. This isn't even, that's a 45 degree angle. The one he almost fell backwards on was probably 60 degrees. <laughs> okay.